emotion see through your flaws. Subscribe for more videos. I know that you got so much more. I'm going to be answering the question of, am I trying to be on my 600 pound life? If 600 pound life offered you a spot on their show, would you accept? Yes. I'm trying to gain weight so I can apply to be on my 600 pound life. Even if I'm not trying to make it to 600 pounds, I will make it to 600 pounds. They've contacted me before though. And like, I'm not train wreck enough. Like I don't have enough problem. I was born on drugs. So we know my mom did drugs even before I was born. I'm not knocking the show. It's an amazing show, but the people on that show can't do things for themselves. Even just them showering is super, super hard. No, I shower just like everyone else. I do it all by myself. So when I clean myself, take off my clothes, take off my bra, take off my panties, that I use a stick to clean myself. <laughs> Except for the vagina and the booty, if you know what I'm saying. Reach my arm in and bend down and grab my because my stomach is in the way. Becky is my caregiver, but I won't do the shower scene. So I'm just saying, no shower scene. I'm good. As of right now, like people actually thinking I could be on that show, like kind of like, what? Do you not watch the show? And the things that people go through, like I'm nowhere near that. And, uh, but they have contacted me before. First I said no, second time I said yes, but I wasn't train wreck enough. I come from a crazy family, <laughs> it's the truth. <laughs> I come from drug addicts, bipolar people, um, mentally ill people, just, I do. That is the family I come from. Did you honestly think that I was gonna be the only normal one? <laughs> Did you? Um, and then if they, I would say yes again. Like literally I would, just Dr. Now's mean though, but I'd be down. I'd be down to talk to him. <laughs> and I love the show, honestly. Like I cry every single episode. These people are super inspiring, but it's like you're on a like TV show where you're literally getting handed a surgery by a famous surgeon and you have all these doctors there for you like just ready to help you and you're gonna fail i can't imagine these people are super inspiring i'm not trying to gain weight and like become super unhealthy to be on a tv show like yeah that would it would honestly be an experience and i always watch these episodes of people failing and it's like okay i get it like you fail it's easy to do because i do it all the time gotta be honest if i was 600 pounds i would not apply to be on that show i wouldn't apply to be on any tv show because like no no thank you like yes contact tlc all of you everyone watching this say amberlyn reed would love to be on your show she would get you good views hopefully it's just not my thing i don't think i would last in a tv show i don't think i'd be good for it no like truly i would be a success story i feel it in my like soul because there's no way there's no way that you put me on tv and see me fail there's no way that's so embarrassing like i know i'm up here on youtube failing but that's different this is youtube put me on a tv show Ooh. i'm about to lose me some weight <laughs> you know so like, it did go through it did go through my mind at one point to apply for the biggest loser but then i was like i don't want to embarrass myself on TV just for money. Like that's not who I am at all. That's just not who I am as a person. And anyways, the fact that people think I'm that type of person is like, whoa. If you think I'm such like a bad person because I feel like that's a bad thing to do, gain a ton of weight just to be on TV. <sighs> that makes you a bad person. It makes you want to be like TV famous and like, like you want a ton of attention even if it's like putting you at risk of dying. Always trying to see through your flaws Cause I know that you got so much more to give You made a real mess but I miss you though Cause I can go to sleep when I'm alone again Say you wanna fix our problems How long should I be waiting? Feels like I've had too much of drama but I'm not ready to give in